Zimbabwe's border Gezi militia training reintroduction on the cards. The government has disclosed plans to reinstate the controversial National Youth Service NYS, commonly referred to as the Border Gezi Youth Militia Training, which is often colloquially known as the Green Bombers due to their distinctive green training uniforms. Originally established as a youth militia in the 2000s by the late youth minister and ZANU-PF stalwart Border Gezi. The ZANU-PF-linked NYS has faced accusations of engaging in acts of terror, assault, rape, and violence against opposition supporters during elections, particularly in rural areas. The National Youth Service NYS faced criticism when initially introduced at the turn of the millennium due to its association with mandatory military training, political indoctrination, and election-related violence. Deputy Youth Minister Kudikwash Mupamhanga recently stated that discussions are underway regarding the relaunch of the program. He assured that the proposed program represents a significant departure from its earlier iteration. At the moment, I can provide specifics. Deliberations are ongoing, and I cannot break the news unilaterally. However, I can share that we intend to reintroduce the National Youth Service. And we are currently in the consultation phase. The Parliamentary Portfolio Committee gathered feedback nationwide during the last session, and there was also input to the Youth Minister in Cabinet. He explained. Despite reservations expressed by civil society organizations, citing concerns about the potential use of the NYS as a political tool for violence, Mupam Hanga emphasized that the reintroduction plans align with the Youth Bill. As mentioned before, we aim to incorporate a volunteer component to allow these young individuals to receive training, empowerment, cultural and identity lessons, and engage in voluntary activities for the betterment of the country. He added. He further noted that the ongoing work involves collaboration among several ministries through an interministerial arrangement, indicating that extensive consultations are taking place on the matter. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.